do really feel like other people are going to come forward. That was Roger Bands, PDD's former bodyguard for nine years, 2003 to 2012. Now, after the video of PDD's um, physical um, assault on Cassie in a hotel room, I believe, in 2016 at the London Hotel, two major people have come out to speak about who worked in PDD's inner circle to speak about what they saw happen during Cassie and PDD's time together. One was, like I said, Roger Bands, his former bodyguard, and the second one was Kevin of Cassie's makeup um, artist. According to Roger Barnes, he saw several things over the years and he uh, accused Didi of having what he called the God Syndrome. I think, I think it's a God Syndrome. Speaking on an incident that had occurred in 2009 during his interview with Piers Morgan, the British journalist, Roger Barnes speaks about how he was witness to Cassie's injuries after the incident in the London Hotel in 2009 where Cassie actually had some bruises, some physical bruises that he constantly would check up on her and see how she was doing. And when Piers had asked him about previous interactions with women and if he had seen him be physical with any other person other than Cassie, this was his response. How many times did you personally witness him be violent towards women? Uh, around four or five times. And was that all with Cassie or was it Cassie and other women? Uh, I seen him with Cassie and I seen him with Kim Porter, his uh, kid's mother. Now, according to Roger, during that interview, he claims that PDD always knew about the existence of that video but and he refers to cassie's claim in her lawsuit where she said that she had pdd had paid fifty thousand dollars at the time to the london hotel to get a copy of the video but what he did not know at the time was that cassie was also given a copy of that video so these are some of the evidences that it seems that Cassie might have presented during her lawsuit that pushed PDD to pay up the amount of money that he paid to Cassie in the, in the amount of time that he did because he paid that money real quick. He knew those cameras was there, you know, but of course, as we heard, he came back to the hotel and he paid to get the footage, mm. but didn't know which Cassie said inside a complaint that they gave her a copy of the footage also. Based on his experience, Roger also alludes to the fact that this was just not a one-off affair, but it's something repetitive, and it appears that there might be some anger, deeper, deeper anger issues that is behind this extent of physical anger and treatment of women in his life. Listen to Roger once again. Sometimes I felt like what are you mad at? What are you upset about? Because it's it's a deeper anger when you hitting and punching a woman in that type of manner. And it's okay. It's 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 understood if you have a problem with one woman and you seek thing. But when you have a problem with every woman that you're dealing with, then I think that problem is inside of you. Another person who spoke about what she saw was Myla Morales doing an interview in another media outlet. She spoke about something she experienced in 2016 where after an altercation between Cassie and PDD, um, Cassie suffered some bruises herself on, on her face and all of that during the at the Beverly Hills Hotel during the, the I think it was the Grammys of some sort and how that they couldn't take Cassie to the hospital because they didn't want anybody to find out about her injuries. And she was so scared because people around PDD were afraid to speak up because they didn't know what was going to happen to them. And so she actually had to, PDD asked her to take care of the incident and she had to take Cassie home with her to, until Cassie was rested up and, and healed up. And so this seems to be a pattern of behavior. It's repetitive anger issues might be involved in it. Something deeper is happening on the inside that needs to get sorted, that needs to get dealt with. And until he does that, it's just unbelievable 
to me for me to imagine that this is the last of what we're going to hear so many other victims are coming out just like roger said that he's pretty sure that there are more people so we're going to see what the next couple of days unfolds but if you've got anger issues deal with it we ladies if you are in an unhealthy relationship know that it doesn't just affect you mentally but it does affect you emotionally psychologically get help get out i'll see you in the next video